Okay, damn, hair's a little messy, but I just woke up. But anyways, we are going to be benching today. I'm gonna be wearing my singlet also since we're really close to the meet. I gotta get used to, you know, wearing the singlet during lifts. So you guys are gonna see me in my singlet again for today's bench day. Um, I'm not gonna do my hair, even though it's super messy, I'm not gonna do it because I'm at the home gym and then I'm just gonna shower afterwards anyways before work. So let's get to it. I actually have two singlets. So this is the OG SBD colorway. Um, they don't sell this red anymore. It's like a whole different design. So this is like the OG OG. And this right here is old Eclipse limited edition one. I don't know if they actually sell Eclipse anymore, but it's just black and white. Way. <laughs> oh. Okay. Hello, Chihiro. How are you doing today? You're gonna see me go through warm ups and everything I do for mobility and stuff before I work out. I don't know how long it usually takes me, maybe like 15 minutes, but yeah. Also, if you guys are wondering the noise in the background, I'm watching Twitch. So looking at, oh shit, I almost fell. So looking at today's program, it looks like I'm doing 225 for three sets of three. We're gonna see how that goes. This is the last set of 225 for three. Got the wrist wraps on. Code FKN, Village Head in an Iron Lincoln Bio. Thank you to everyone that has used my code though. Um, the extra support really helps a lot, so. But anyways, we are going to do our last set and I'm going to pick one of the most, let's see. This song hypes me up a lot, I'll show you guys. This song right here? Just focus. You know, there's no need for you to worry yourself. Except my sword. Alright, just finished the workout, just finished uh, cleaning all the weights up and stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and make my go to protein shake, and it's about like a thousand or so calories. Basically, for the shake, what you want to do is what, we're going to start off with one cup of oats. Let's see. We're going to do 12 ounces of milk. I like to use the Fairlife milk because it's lactose free and I don't like getting the shits. But one serving scoop of whey whole standard protein. This is the protein I've been using ever since I started years ago and I've stuck with it. It's the gold standard so might as well stick with it. Two scoops of almond butter. Two tablespoons. It gets kind of stuck in the spoon so I use a chopstick, metal chopstick, to like kind of scoop it out. I kind of usually eye this. I do one cup of blueberries, frozen blueberries, and then one cup of strawberries. And there you go, that's the shake. Hey, uh, that's fucking horrible, I hate this shake. I fucking love this shake, dude. This is the struggles of having like a fast metabolism. Like obviously there's no excuses, everyone can gain fucking weight, but some have to eat more than others, and I have to eat a lot more than others. <laughs> I just finished the shake, now we're going to go game before work. We're going to go ahead and game real quick though. In the pen. After I shower, I hate going on my computer if I feel dirty, so I'm going to go shower. We are exactly one week out. You guys just saw me make my pre-workout shake. Um, it's nothing too crazy, it's mainly just to get a a little bit of calories, mostly carbs in me before my workout. 
There is eight ounces of mango juice, eight ounces of cranberry juice, uh, a banana, and then to help get my greens in for the day, I do like two handfuls of kale, one handful of spinach. So I'm gonna drink this, wait for it to digest, go to the gym. It's deadlifts today, it's a Saturday. Um, like I said, one week out, exactly one week out. I just woke up too, that's why I, I look like this and I sound like this. I'm gonna take a shower after I drink this shake. Right now we're just gonna watch maybe some Twitch or do some homework. All right, so we're about to go and uh, go to the gym to do deadlifts. Uh, the cool thing about having a home gym though is I can actually warm up here and I live like two minutes away from the gym so I can just warm up here and then just uh, go straight to the gym and get straight into my working sets so that's what we're gonna do. I mean you necessarily don't really need to roll out to warm up. Um, more dyna dynamic stretching and doing certain movements is a lot more optimal I guess, a lot more efficient but I've been rolling out since I first started so this kind of gets me in the zone so I'm just gonna stick with it uh, just cuz I'm going a little earlier today I woke up earlier also mainly because um, this is my first time going with a camera and even though I, I even though I do film on my phone at the gym um, having an like an actual camera now I, I just feel self-conscious so I'm back to square one again um, we're gonna try it out try to get comfortable with it alright so we just showed up to the gym it's a lot more crowded than I expected uh, oh well so we're still gonna try to record even though I'm gonna feel a little self-conscious but yeah whatever alright so after about 30 minutes of waiting we finally got a platform uh, we're gonna start deadlifting, start with warm-ups. We have to work up to top triple today, I believe, at like 455 to 465, some shit like that. Um, but yeah, one week out. Let's hope this goes nice and smooth. Instead of bringing water to the gym, everyone should bring hot tea. I got chamomile mint, nice and warm. It's flavored and it's still hydrating because it's non-caffeinated. So if you're watching this, bring tea instead of water, you know? We just got an upper body day today. Luckily, I've been deadlifting long enough to where the gym's kind of died down. So it's kind of empty in here. Uh, but yeah. Okay, that was the last set. But now we gotta unload the weight. You guys have seen me do this like hundreds of times. No, not hundreds, like tens of times. Before I do anything, this sweater is fucking fire. It's from fucking awesome. It's a skate shop. I used to be a skater back then, so I usually wear skater clothes. Just finished deadlifts. Now we're on an upper. I like to usually do a back movement. It looks like everyone's kind of doing back day today, so I think I'm just gonna do like, I'll do a chest movement, maybe a uh, flat barbell bench press. I'm gonna show you something cool about the benches here at my local gym. bit of Pierce the Veil playing. Yeah. 
I really like this machine better than the one you see JPG usually usually using JPG usually using because it already has you at an angle and if you want to you can use leg drive if you want so this is like my go-to for upper We're now outside of the gym, walking to my car. I know earlier in the vlog, I talked about how I might feel a little more self-conscious with an actual camera, tripod and all this gear. But in all honesty, I feel, it just feels like I'm recording on my phone. So it doesn't really feel too bad at all. I mean, obviously when people look at you, you're gonna think the worst, but that's just being human. And if they do judge you, I mean like, fuck it dude, you know? Just film what you want to film, so yeah. But if you do see me at the gym, uh, don't be, and you want to say hi, don't be afraid to say hi. I really don't bite. Um, I like to meet the people that support me, especially as a smaller creator, and especially as someone that's like brand new to all of this. So if you want to say hi, go ahead and say hi, you know? Uh, don't be shy. If anything, I'm the shy, oh. If anything, I'm the shy one. Um, but yeah, today um, I had someone come up to me. That's kind of why. I brought up this topic, someone came up to me, said what's up. If your name is Dennis, and you came up to me on fucking, on, on Saturday, the fucking, whatchamacallit, the 28th of January, and you said what's up to me, if your name is Dennis, what's up dude? Uh, appreciate your support, and uh, yeah, hope to see you around the gym, hope you had a great workout today. We're gonna go home, grab a bite to eat, and then play some fucking Valorant, and that'll be my day today. I don't know why I'll film again, but we are officially literally one week, seven days out. It's Saturday, it's gonna be next Saturday, February 4th that I compete, and hopefully I get good footage then that I can put into this vlog, um, or whatever, but yeah. All right, so it is officially four days out from the meet. We finished our SBD day, um, our home gym SBD day. You guys probably saw on Instagram or TikTok or whatever, me and my singlet lifting here at the home gym. Um, so that was yesterday. Um, it's gonna be relatively light today, because we are tapered down now. So it was like medium-ish uh, weight yesterday. Friday, I'm just gonna mainly do technique work, which is gonna be me um, squat, bench, and deadlifting, literally nothing over 135, 100 something pounds. I'm not gonna go above that. It's just gonna be technique lifting. I am not the best when it comes to prep for a meet. I, I'm like, for the years I've been doing this, I've always just kind of just full sent it. And I mean, People always ask me, oh, do you have a coach or anything? I'm like, no, I don't. If I had a coach, I'd be way better about everything. For my pre-workout, I like to mix BPN, uh, flight, BPN supplements, flight pre-workout with Gatorade. I usually drink like half the Gatorade and then, or like I leave like a quarter or a half of the Gatorade and then I mix in the BPN. Um, I usually get like a towel like this and funnel it. I don't have a funnel. I should probably get a funnel, but Whatever. Actually, I think I do have a funnel. Oh. Holy crap. After, after, like I don't even know how long I'm doing this. I forgot I had a funnel. Let's see. Maybe only like, like half a scoop. Okay, that's not really half a scoop, but whatever. We just took the pre-workout. I am feeling like, Kind of hungry right now, though. I'm not gonna lie. So I'm probably gonna go across the street and grab like snacks or something. You know, powerlifter snacks, rice krispies, and stuff. So I'm gonna go grab those. I was just talking to one of the people from Village Hidden and Iron. I'm getting a package sent out. I'm gonna I'm gonna do an unboxing video later in this vlog. Okay, so we're gonna grab some rice krispie treats. So awkward. I don't like it. Okay, that was actually that's actually so fucking awkward. I don't know how content creators do that, like film in the grocery store. I felt so awkward like looking at the camera and talking to myself. I never want to do that again. I probably will do it again. 
unfortunately, but. I'm gonna bring a bag of these, yes, on Saturday. And I'm also coaching someone for the Sunday session, so I'll be there Sunday also, so I. Oh, it's like lubing my throat. I have two cats. They track a shit ton of fur or like leftover litter, whatever, all over the carpet. I don't like to warm up laying down on the ground in that stuff, so I vacuum. So I'll be wearing these knee sleeves to the meet, which is why I'm wearing these sleeves all week anytime I squat. And I'm wearing the One Hun Co, the, the matching ones, the One Hun Co uh, deadlift slippers for squat and deadlift. However, I will be wearing my Notorious Lifts for bench just because I get a better grip with the Notorious Lifts. When it comes to bench, I do use leg drive, but otherwise I use these for deadlift and squat. <sighs> Oh, let's go. I just got a shipment from uh, from the village. It's a hoodie. I'm going to zoom in. I want to show you guys already. You can't really see it, but that's the most you guys can get out of it. Um, it's called the Splash Hoodie. So if you guys go on Village Hidden and Iron and check that out, it's really nice. Can't wait to get that. Okay, we're like about three days out. It's Wednesday. Um, we're just going to grab some bagels from the bagel place I was talking about earlier in the vlog. Um, and fortunately, we do have our package that I was talking about yesterday from Village Hidden Iron coming in today. I guess they did like express delivery or something that's really cool. Fit for today, no workout. Um, we're only gonna be working out tomorrow and Friday, mainly for technique work. Shout out to Village Hidden and Iron. All right, you know, at this point, we're just gonna try to open it up as difficulty as difficulty as difficult as possible just because I can't find a knife, so. And then the backsies. Okay, I didn't know that there was a second package, so I had to go back to the office and pick up this one. Sick, this is, these are shorts from the bread collection. The red ones right here. You can get down in a squat with these two. This is the Divine. I think these might be my new favorite. If you guys want any anime lifting gear, be sure to check out the link in my bio. Use code FKN at checkout. It really does help me, and I really do so. Um, I really do appreciate all the support I've been given and all the people that have used my code. Um, I just wanted to make sure that <clears throat> I just wanted to make sure that when you guys do use my code, post it as an Instagram story or anything on social media and tag me. I like to know what you guys end up getting, and I would like to repost your shit too. So yeah. If you guys also end up going to the meet, or if you see me around there, feel free to say hi. Why am I saying this right now? This vlog is gonna come out after the meet. I'm fucking stupid. All right. I don't think I look good with the mid part, huh? Right to the side. All right, we're just gonna leave it like this for now. What is going on YouTube? So, okay. Um, we just woke up like about an hour ago. I already took my pre-workout. And uh, we're going to mainly just lift for technique today. Uh, we're doing a full squat bench dead uh, just for technique today. <clears throat> still suffering still suffering this cough. Yes, I know it's only 135 and I'm wearing knee sleeves, wrist wraps, and a belt. But it's literally just technique practice. I'm So, I'm pretty much just, um, with all that movement, 
made me hungry. But yeah, uh, I'm originally from the Bay. Um, I'm just gonna let it out there. I live in Davis, California currently. Um, all of my friends are from the Bay though. Uh, they, a lot of them are actually coming. They got an Airbnb in Sacramento. The meet that I'm doing is in Sacramento. It's like 20 minutes away. <coughs> Still have this cough. This cough is gonna fuck me during the meet, I know. It. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna find out. Um, maybe I'll introduce you to my friend group. Um, and yeah. If I don't vlog today, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Uh, we just arrived at uh, my homie's Airbnb. Uh, they're from the Bay originally, so um, this is in Sacramento. They decided to get a Airbnb, make it easier for them. I'm not gonna stay here, but I'm gonna come kick it uh, for the day, uh, then go back home. We are gonna go through early check-ins today as well. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and say what's up to them. Anybody home? No, no one's here. What's up, dude? That's hey, cool? Hey, okay, hey. for sure. This is my boy Christian. Yo, We're competing together uh, tomorrow. Uh, this looks like their Airbnb over here. What's up, oh, bro? Nice. <laughs> <Perfect kid. laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we just arrived at 3rd Street. Early check in. The parking lot is fucked, actually. So this is the inside of uh, Third Street. This is where I'll be competing tomorrow, Saturday. I'm gonna be lifting at 8 a.m. PST. But anyways, we just did our rack heights. Just did equipment check and shit. I'm um, just helping my homie out. He's this guy right here, seven foot tall, stallion. Uh, he's taken, unfortunately. Sorry about that. But yeah. Uh, my mom seems to be doing better. What's up? <laughs> it's your boy. Yes, sir. Hey, we out here in Third Street, man. We from Texas. Yeah? Everything bigger than Texas. Oh, Fuck shit. You're <laughs> from hella far out. What's up? I'm Jacob. Nice to meet you. <laughs> All right, so
session two I was session one um, so we're gonna help out my friend that's doing session two um, with his warm-ups you know and I'm gonna record a bit of him too his lifts so don't be surprised if you see him in the vlog also Everything you got, let's go! 